big up, big up, big up, big up. We must left now with something for the Sunday. We can say Sunday gospel, just a quick idea. But also we just noticed something. Since as much as the page they grow, we need to be able to even play anybody else in music. Because when they get a copyright bridge, you know, try for entertain on that just now. You know, with some few, you know, Niger songs there. You know, be careful the later. But anyway, Sunday preaching or Sunday gospel or Sunday idea or another Sunday truth. The old Egyptian ideas there or the concepts there wouldn't be used for get for worship. Compared to now, the recent, the contemporary, how things change, how humans can evolve, how the idea also can change and evolve, you know? Um, I feel like, you know, so we all just they learn as we go, you know? In those days, the Egyptians, they believe, say, don't make this quick. That when you die, you got to also get something for offer to the gods in the afterlife. Now, I make most of them, when they die, they, they bury them with the riches them. Whatever gold they may get, silver, diamond, even some, whatever animal they may possess. Also, even they slaves them, if they own slaves them, they, they kill them slaves them, they, what to mean, mortal man. They. If person be on you, then that person they die wanna be a wealthy person. You wouldn't be own, you they die with that person. They. Now, so the world be cruel. The world not be civilized, not be understand, you know? So the old Egyptian concept, where you die, if you go with your riches there, maybe in the afterlife, you will go back in, but say your riches there, for make an a heaven, or the promised land, etc., etc. Well, when I see how we recent scientists and only discover so many of them, you know, then gold or the minerals there. Yeah. See what somebody for Kelgo afterlife is still in a grown. But could discover us they can go inside Egypt and all the other countries there. They yeah, they go dig out certain things there yeah, and own them. So must not say the Egyptians and then be smart, but not be too smart enough. Because we can't to religious practice, they might be confused. You know? Then believe say they will go with them wealth. Well, and we contemporary or we recent, but couldn't go dig them graves there. Don't take ownership of all them wealth they are, them minerals or gold or diamonds they are. Then back don't sell and make money out of it. You know? That ain't be the old concept. So another concept today, around Abraham in time, for them we say for give sacrifice. You know, if I kill a goat or a cow or what, a lamb. You know, to the God system for make sacrifice. Knowledge still be the grow. You know? But that's not take man nowhere. That's not take man nowhere. And as time involves, now what's the man get for realize to the coming of Christ? Etc. etc. That's now listen now to this so the most important part. Now you good deeds them. The good thing that what you do now this world. Now I ain't gonna take you go heaven. Not to the money where you beget, not to what you possess, not to how many sacrifices you make, or how many sarah you make, but the good things the way you do now this world or this dunya, how you had pure, how you had clean, now you take you go heaven or to paradise. So now make in some religious books then they can say they can weigh your soul, whether or not your heart or your soul or whatsoever, or see. What's one good? Now, so that be used for use the same system. That's what you care when the afterlife, you reach them, then go where? But that's not make any sense. You sacrifice don't make any sense. Now, you good did send it away. For making a heaven. And that concept say come, you know, through the coming of Christ. And prophets Muhammad also continue for preach that. So, not so what you possess again. Not how many sacrifices do you make, not how many sarah do you make, etc. etc. If you're not good in this world, your soul is totally dark. 
I do good, tell you do good now for nothing back. If you sold dark. I do good, tell you do good now for nothing. Because you soul for lead you to enlightenment, to purity, to salvation, to goodness. And if you do unrighteously. So you good it plus you soul. You got for balance properly. Forget you to the gods the way make we. We need money for understand that. That concepts are always evolve. They, they change. And we don't learn more better. You know, we on time, we don't understand more better. I believe say the more generations need to come, hopefully they can become more inspired for no more better than we. Because we still get the sinful one here. You know, the sin is cool. So now we Sunday gospel this. We now make a long, we just want church now with that. You know, we're not going to think about what you do now this world. What's more important? Or the things the way they go after. What's more important again? You know? Now you riches and wealth, because we all want that comfortability. We all want a good life. But make sure say, you go about things the right way. Not go and sin along the way. Because then they go trap your soul. And you want your soul to be free. You go for believing after life, and indeed there is a life after death. Whether you go down at the good side or, or you know the posit, I mean the bad side. You know, but there is life after death. You know, this is not just a vessel. The body will get not just a vessel. Now it temporarily carcass. You know? Now that's it. But now what's in the inside, you know, I mean something. Now, now the light, now the light stand there where they can go further. Whether not to the God step or to the darker side. But you get a light inside you, or we can see the fire inside you. You know? And make sure say, this fire continue for be pure. You know, continue for learn for do good. You know, in a practical way. When I stay blessed again on a boy Taz Muslim servant, aka Bepe Kong will link up tomorrow. Lord we try for walk towards salvation. Don't walk towards Allah. You know, and we'll see good things happen in our lives still. When I stay blessed.